Which gas is the most essential for all of us to live? The gas which we breathe in. It's the oxygen gas. Let's determine its magnetic properties with the help of molecular orbital theory. Oxygen is a colorless, odorless and tasteless gas which consists of stable diatomic molecules. However, when liquefied, oxygen is pale blue in color. This pale blue liquid has a paramagnetic character. This means if liquid oxygen is poured over a horseshoe magnet, it remains suspended in between the poles. To do so, let us actually build the MO diagram of the oxygen molecule. Each of the combining oxygen atoms has an electronic configuration of 1s2, 2s2, 2px1, 2py1, 2pz2. The 1s and 2s atomic orbitals of these combining atoms form sigma, that is bonding, and sigma star, denoting the anti-bonding molecular orbitals respectively. Let us arbitrarily choose the z-axis as the internuclear axis. Just as the s orbitals, the 2pz orbitals facing each other in a head-to-head -head fashion shall combine axially and form two molecular orbitals. The bonding sigma 2pz and the anti-bonding sigma star 2pzmo respectively. These orbitals can be arranged in the MO diagram as shown. Simultaneously, the other 2p orbitals which lie perpendicular to the 2pz overlap sideways. This sideways overlap of atomic orbitals results in pi molecular orbitals. Two of the 2py orbitals form bonding pi 2py and the anti-bonding pi star 2py orbitals. Similarly, the 2px orbitals form bonding pi 2px and the anti-bonding pi star 2px orbitals. The order of energy of the pi 2p molecular orbitals of oxygen is as shown. Electrons can be accommodated in these molecular orbitals in accordance with the Aufbau and Pauli's principles. The resulting electronic configuration of O2 is as shown. Note that before getting paired up, the electrons occupy the pi star 2py and pi star 2px molecular orbitals singly. This is in accordance with the third rule, which is the Hund's rule. Does this distribution of electrons cause paramagnetism in the oxygen molecule? Yes. The two electrons in the anti-bonding pi star 2py and pi star 2px orbitals are unpaired. Due to these two unpaired electrons, oxygen is strongly paramagnetic in nature. To summarize, we have studied that liquefied oxygen is paramagnetic in nature. That is, it remains suspended in between the poles of a horseshoe magnet. The paramagnetic behavior of liquefied oxygen can be explained by its MO diagram, which shows the presence of two unpaired electrons, making the molecule paramagnetic. We know that there are attractive interactions within the covalent molecules. But are there any interactions between the covalent molecules? We will discuss it in the upcoming videos. Keep imbibing. We believe in you.